hello 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 kenny evans here another car video and the title of this video is will and jada are in an open marriage but before i get into that i have to say you know uh, again this channel is not just for me it is for you guys and really it's not even for me it's for you guys i just created a channel but it is for you guys Help y'all be the best you can be in all aspects of your life, men and women. You know, uh, it's not just dating and relationships. I know that's the main thing I talk about, but it's not the only thing. Also, health, wealth, and mindset. So you can be a complete person and be the best person you can be in all aspects of your life. And after that, um, so obviously I've had some new people here. Uh, welcome. I've had some people who've been here for a while. Uh, still welcome again. But. You know, I have some people who haven't subscribed, new and old. So, that being said, uh, whether you're watching this video, uh, it's new or old, subscribe, hit that notification button so you'll be notified for whenever I make some, uh, upload some new videos. And, of course, if you just want to support me or if you like my videos, hit the like button, hit that thumbs up, I appreciate it. So, let's get back to the topic at hand. <sighs> Will and Jada are in an open uh, marriage. So it's uh, the, you know, Will did a, a video or an interview with G GQ about him being in an open uh, marriage with Jada. And I'm actually going to link that video in the description so you can watch it yourself. And yeah, it's just a lot, man. You know, it's, uh, <laughs> they had this. You know, picture of who people thought they were in the public eye. And, uh, you know, there's been a little bit of rumors about them, you know, for, for years. Now they finally confirmed them, you know, and, um, you know, it's a lot of a lot of stuff. But it can also teach you that there's nothing wrong with being in a non-monogamous relationship if that's what makes you happy. You know, so there's nothing wrong with being happy, if especially if it's with more than one person. You know, so it is what it is. Don't judge them for doing what they got to do to be happy. Because I'm sure there's some stuff in your closet that you've done or that you're doing right now that people would judge you in a negative light for. And you wouldn't want to be judged. So just let them live their life. Let them be happy and you do the same. But of course, like I said, first and foremost... There have been rumors about Will and Jada for years about them being in an open relationship. And now, again, they just confirmed it. You know, so, again, they're doing what they got to do to be happy. And there's nothing wrong with that, you know. And, in fact, more people would probably be happier if they were in open relationships. If you consider the marriage rates is declining over these past few years birth rate is dec declining here in america and the divorce rate is skyrocketing or increasing here in america more people would probably be happier in uh, open ma marriages or relationships because now you don't have that commitment to somebody who you really don't want to be committed to forever and if maybe you did want to be committed to that person in the beginning, now you have at least an out, semi out without having to get divorced, you know? So it is definitely an alternative. And of course, it's always been here forever, but you have to be willing to do it. And it takes courage. It takes strength. I know you strong men and women out there would be willing to do it because you all about putting your happiness first and finding people who will be willing to put your happiness first. Because you always got to take care of yourself first before you can take care of somebody else. If you're not happy, you're not going to make anybody else happy. So, but yeah, that is that, you know. People should be looking into more non-monogamous relationships because the way American relationships are, or at least uh, marriages are right now, they're not, they're not good. So, but yeah, yeah, yeah. So they've been in uh, open marriage since the beginning. 27 years they've been married, I believe. You know, and they finally admitted it. Will is 53. Jada, I'm sure she's younger than him. I don't know her age. 
But they finally admitted it after 27 years. All the rumors that they've been, that they're in an open uh, marriage. <laughs> you know what I mean? So everything that everybody was talking about was true. But that also brings me to my third point. So Will's reaction to uh, August Alsina and Jada's entanglement was fake. It was fake. World-renowned actor Will Smith, everybody. You know, so it's like, it's, a, it's an incredible thing. He knew, obviously, they were in an open relationship, an open marriage. But he also knew that some people would look at him crazy if he didn't have any reaction. And he didn't get mad. And I think that it was a tall tale sign that people should have looked at. He did not get mad. He didn't get mad at her. He didn't get mad at August. So clearly he didn't care, <laughs> you know, but people who peeped that, they understood what it was all about, you know what I mean? But for y'all who didn't, I mean, you see the memes about Will Smith, and but he really didn't care. He didn't have any sort of reaction, negative reaction. He was just very cool, calm, collected, you know what I mean? So that was a, a tall tale sign that he really was comfortable with the situation. You know, because he, if he was in a strictly monogamous relationship, he could have easily divorced her. I mean, that would, I mean, in Hollywood, that's the thing to do. But the fact that he didn't, they stayed together, they seemed to be happy, that should have been a sign that, yeah, things aren't completely monogamous for for their uh, marriage. So, but yeah, you know, even with that, you know, you got uh, your boy. Will Smith, in the interview, you talking about he wanted to have a harem of 20 women, including Halle Berry. Including Halle Berry. And that could have been interesting considering, you know, Halle Berry has a, her own relationship issues and, and dramas, you know what I mean? And, but yeah, she's still, she fine. <laughs> she's still fine, even at her age. She's still fine, you know what I mean? But I can't blame Will Smith, man. He wanted to get at Halle, man. She's she's sexy, you know. But she got a lot of issues and baggage when it comes to her own relationships too. So that would have been an interesting uh, situation to say the least. But um, then you got your boy, Will, in the interview again. He says that he and Jada are not responsible for each other's happiness within that relationship. And it makes sense because despite what you may believe, you cannot get everything you want from one person. Or let me say this. It is very rare that you get everything you want from one person in a relationship. You get the sex, you get the money, you get the emotional, you get the intelligence, you get the social, you get the, the, the sense of humor, everything, the personality, everything in one person is just rare. It is possible, but it is rare. And that's why you see a lot of these women out here, you know, um, in their 30s, 40s, looking for that perfect person. You know, because they have come to the realization it is rare, but they believe they'll be able to find that person, that perfect man for them to get married to. You know what I mean? Instead of finding a guy who checks most of your boxes, they want to find the guy who checks all their boxes. So, um, and that's true. What Will said. He and Jada cannot fulfill each other, all their happiness with each other. That's why they have to get other people. And again, there's nothing wrong with that. Different strokes for different folks. You know what I mean? So, again, don't be judging Will and Jada for what they, they, they came out and finally confirmed that people knew for all these years. Because again, we all got skeletons and we all got things that, uh, you know, we don't want everybody to to judge us about. And at the end of the day, what they're doing is actually really normal. At least they're doing it in a healthy way. They're not cheating. They're not having a toxic relationship. And again, Will said divorce is not an option for him, him and Jada. So they got to do what they got to do to make it work. And that's what they're doing. So that's all I got with, for y'all. Uh, let me know what you think, whether you think it's crazy, uh, whether you think it's okay, 
um, that they're in an open marriage, that, or at least that they finally admit it? You know, do you think, um, you know, I mean, you could be, just give me your opinion. Don't got to be negative, just give me your opinion. You know what I mean? Obviously, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button, and if you even you dislike the video, leave me a comment. Let me know how come you dislike the video so I can make better videos in the future. Um, of course, if you found value in the video, uh, you can donate. Any little bit counts. You know, of course, only if you found value. And, of course, last but not least, y'all stay safe. Uh, stay strong out there, you know, what I mean in this world of craziness You know and I will see y'all next week, but always remember The strongest man is the happiest man